Hello, as a business analyst, my role entails working with COPA, or Cost and Profitability Analysis. This is one of the most powerful tools provided by SAP, for it gives our organization the ability to collect cost of sales data by customer and product, and additionally allocate general expenses to these dimensions. These expenses may be marketing, admin, sales, or services expenses. With COPA, we are able to see the profitability of a product for a group of customers or for even an individual customer. In this short presentation, I will show you how this process has worked until very recently and how this process has been dramatically improved since the introduction of SAP HANA to our IT landscape and how one important trade-off has been removed. But first, let me show you how I have been working until recently. In SAP ERP I can access the reports I require at any time by simply navigating the menu tree. Under Accounting, Controlling, Profitability Analysis and Information System I can access the transaction to execute reports. I select the report I require, in this case Actual Customer Sales, and run that report for the fiscal year 2010. Now this is where my problems begin. There has always been a trade-off between the amount of detail of the different expense allocations, i.e. the number of individual documents that are posted, and the time needed to run a cost and profitability analysis report. We as an organisation are entering very many individual documents to be as accurate as possible in our allocations, but as a result our reports tend to take quite a bit of time to run. So now it is more than five minutes later, my report is ready for viewing. I can sort these revenue figures into descending order. And drill into the largest month, September. And then into a particular region, DE0015, Southern Germany. And now I can see the figures for our individual products. Again, I'm sorting these figures in descending order. And now I'm scrolling up to find the one with the largest total, in this case Sunfun. And drilling into this product Sunfun, I can see the individual customers within the region southern Germany that have bought this particular product. I can now take a look at the individual expense documents that have been posted for this customer and this product. If only the trade-off between the amount of detail and the time to run each report could be removed, we would be really able to calculate the profitability of each product at each customer and obviously have a much higher control on the discounts our sales teams could offer. Well, thanks to SAP HANA, the trade-off has now been lifted. I am now using SAP Business Objects Explorer, a browser application. I select the same IDAS Act report and I can sort and drill down in the data in a very similar way, but I now have the added benefit of a graphical representation of data which changes each time I make a different selection. All this is instantaneous and I can do this at ease, since it is having no effect on our operational ERP system, as it is all running in a separate in-memory database using SAP HANA. I drill down into the same data as I did before, fiscal year 2010, Put a filter on net revenue after deductions. Select the period 9, remember that is September. The same sales district, DE0015, Southern Germany. And finally, the same product, Sunfun. Here we can see a list of documents which we can compare with our previous report run in SAP ERP. However, let's remember, not only was this much faster, but it is also available in real time, directly after posting, which I will now show you in the next stage. I'm now going to post a new expense document directly in the ERP system. I'm going to use the document number 
and post this using the document number 08000030012 as reference so as to speed up the process. I now save the document and have confirmation that the document 09000000006 has been created. Let's now take a look in SAP Business Objects Explorer again. Taking the IDIS Act information space once again, Let's focus as before on the net revenue after deductions. If I scroll to the right I can find the document numbers. Then if I sort these documents in descending order I can see the document that I have just recently posted in SAP ERP namely document number 09000006. This search was done on a total of over 8 million records and took less than a third of a second. As you can see, SAP HANA allows us to continue with our policy of defining ever more detailed expense assignments by allocating, for example, a marketing budget at customer level based on turnover rather than a generic split and then analyze the results faster than ever before.